And we can, we're back to Mass Effect 3. Dark and Yay. Ran. Have Hello. Cured the Genophage and done a whole bunch of dialogue and a little bit of side questing. Yep. We need to head to the Citadel for an urgent meeting, but first, Liara wants to have a chat. So let's have a chat. Yeah. That thing is nice. Tolkien is a free action, right? <laughs> Mm. Hmm. What's the other stuff? There's supposed to be the model of the uh what's it called? Andromeda Arc somewhere around here. Hmm. Oh well. Maybe you need to buy it? We are You had something you wanted to discuss in my cabin? Yes. I'll be right up. Come on in. Thank you. Okay. Could we sit? I've been thinking about the knowledge we gathered on the Reapers, and how easily it could be lost again. So, I put a plan in motion to preserve things for the future. What's this? A record of the galaxy. Information on the Reapers, relays, different cultures, and blueprints of the Crucible. But there's one entry I wanted your opinion on. Which one? Your own. I'd be honored to have your input. How would you like history to remember you? 50,000 years is a long time for a computer to sit around. Please, I was an archaeologist. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm encasing these records in time capsules and seeding copies on multiple planets. And while it's not foolproof, the VI I'm installing has every translation and linguistics program I could find. So it's an information guide like Vigil on Ilos? Yes. I've been preparing it for some time. And it will be a privilege to guide the future discoverers of these records. Oh. Have you decided what you would like Dr. Tassoni to write in your entry, Commander? What do you think? Just be honest, I think. Put down the truth. Good, bad. Don't leave anything up. Let history be the judge. I'll give them the facts. Let me just delete all these breathless passages on your heroics. <laughs> you writing anything I can't live up to? I can't help myself. You're a good friend, Shepard. You've been there for me too, Liara. No, I haven't. I wish I could have joined you back on Ilium. You made up for it. Well, I suppose I did just write your name in the stars. <laughs> she did. Yep. <laughs> right. So let's go find out what the human counselor's been up to. Oh boy. I can't wait to punch him in the face or something. I guess we will have a couple of other things to do in the citadel. Control. This is Normandy. We're headed to Bay One Four, Zakara Ward. Are we clear to descend? What the hell's going on down there? Even if there were a station malfunction, they'd have backups online. 
I got a bad feeling here. Checking emergency channels. Hey, yeah, this is Joker. Uh-huh. Yeah, no kidding. Commander, there's a communication from Thane. He says it's important. I think you'll want to hear this. Put him through. Shepard, the Citadel is under attack. Cerberus troops are everywhere and they're in control of the docks. Are you safe? No. I had to evade their commandos at the hospital. I'm in a Presidium storefront. Did Ashley make it out? We got separated. She said she had to protect the Council. I'm going to CSEC headquarters. Why CSEC headquarters? It's been compromised, and CSEC's response depends on it. As long as Cerberus is holding the headquarters, they have the station. All right. Joker, get us away from the docks and close to CSEC HQ. We'll deploy in the shuttle. Aye, aye, Commander. Nothing's ever simple, is it? Of course not. Okay, we're definitely right, bringing Javik on this one. Yep. Uh, and, uh, James and Garrus. I don't know why. Uh, I know G James and Garrus both have some good lines on this mission. I'm bringing Garrus. Garrus, okay. We can always bring the other some other time. Yeah. I don't know why I even bother checking. Yeah, no, like there's much of a reason to change the uh, gear. Thank him. Civil unrest in every fucking war. That's a word for it. Yeah. Bit of an understatement. Dude, there was the combat in here. God damn it. Why don't you have your own. Never mind. Trying to get rid of that turret. Yeah, at least your power shall charge pretty fast now. Oh, yeah. Hey, you know you have your own turret? I do. Ding. I think? Hmm. Maybe? Uh. I couldn't tell if you missed them or, or if he just had a shield that he lost. That was an assault trooper. So no, I missed. Oh, well, at least oh, Bailey survived. For now. Shepard, I saw those Cerberus troops on you. I thought you were done for. Bailey, what are you doing here? Getting my ass shot off trying to retake headquarters. Cerberus took it in the first push. We gotta kick them out of there. Everyone in CSEC's flying blind without the network. How bad's the situation? Do you know if the counselors are alive? They split up. I'll know more if I can access the terminal inside. Can you get us in? I'll get the door. If no one interrupts me with a bullet this time. About a few bullet holes? You don't say.
Here we go. CSET network access. Courtesy of Cerberus. How's that gonna help? Cerberus has control of the main channels, but I can set up a new one. Without it, our people have no plan and no chance. Hello. What have you got? A warning from Counselor Valern. He's supposed to be here meeting with the Executor. Be on guard. The likelihood of betrayal from within is high. Not a lot else. But if he's inside... Hmm. That must have been a cut line because the line I remember is different. Hmm. Why would the Counselor be meeting with the Executor? Usually it means someone big's about to be prosecuted. I guess that someone had Cerberus friends. The Counselor mentioned Udina. But that's insane. Does he even have this kind of pull? Well, you know who'd have the answer to that? The Counselor. One Counselor's better than zero. Enough. Where am I headed? He could be in the Executor's office. It's a fairly defensible position. I'm on it. Just a sec. There. Now we can talk by Omnitool. Go. Yeah, that's probably useful. Mm-hmm. Hey, did you hear all that? Yes. I'm nearing the building, but running is difficult. I'll try to get to you. Oh, yeah, he's... He was pretty much already in his last legs before. Mm-hmm. And he's dead man walking. Mm -hmm. Nice. I don't give a fuck about your shield. So I see. Maybe I'm always pretty nice. Yep. That's a turret. That. <laughs> That I do give a fuck about. <laughs> I do care about that. But how about turret versus turret? Oh no, oh no. Very much. This is zap. 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 Aww. <laughs> well, my turret won. We'll call that a win. Yep. Okay. Just wondering, can you have your turret and your drone out at the same time? We're about to find out anyway. I already knew the answer to that, but I knew you'd want to see it anyway. Emergency message from Commander Bailey to all officers. Cerberus attack in progress. All hands on deck. No shit. Yeah. Anything down here? Doesn't seem like it. Get off the couch. Yeah, Fire suppression systems. <laughs> okay, I see we're not waiting to open fire. Yeah. yeah, can't wait to hear whatever his shitty excuses are for doing it. Okay, shit. We even give him a chance to, to say anything. I know, right? Ooh. Oh, it's more armor pieces when I wanna use. Machine gun! It's a machine gun! Nice. Cerberus. Didn't even drag him out into the hall. Get off of cover. <laughs> if I start another invisible counter, uh, 
about no. how many times do I see him flee? I think it's twelve. Eh? That's not the power I intended to use. Oh uh, my god. Ooh. That's probably useful. So it's done. Learning new. Not really useful. Ooh, but that is. Indeed. Okay. If the gunfight doesn't give us away, nothing will. How do I open this door? Maybe there's something over here. Maybe. Oh, there's still loot. What's loot? Loot this wood. High caliber bar. Could be useful. Maybe there's something on this end of the room. Perhaps. Personal log, Armando Owen Bailey. <clears throat> Entry one. Warren Herc that he doesn't fill out his reports properly. <clears throat> I'm kicking his ass from one end of the citadel to the other. Entry That's two. That's a long kicking. <laughs> <laughs> Reschedule meeting with customs analysts about cargo weight discrepancies over the past last year. Don't let him wriggle out of that again, damn it. <clears throat> Entry three. Reports of undesirables getting on station illegally. Have biometric systems calibrated. Again. Entry four. Kick her sorry ass from one end of the citadel to the other. Better come through. That would probably do. Either that or it was the other term, you know? Nope, that got it. Talon. Oh my. More stuff. <clears throat> From Sergeant Uriah Shaw to Captain Iana Mao. I brought up number 177504 from evidence so you can see it for yourself. The pistol we, we just picked up. Ah. We caught the slag who was assembling it in one of Tower 110's bathrooms. He got it past the detectors in pieces. Metal barrel and a hollowed out Omni tool. Ezo and one decision toothbrushes. The rest was plastic or ceramic. No gang ink on him. He was in a sport coat like most of the male employees of Tower 110. His ID was manufactured. He's got a record that dates back to when his med card was issued, and before that, nothing. This is way beyond coincidence. This is a pro assassin, and he's not alone. We've got people smuggling talons all over the station. Patrol knows it. Organized crime knows it. Everybody knows it. But when you try to talk to the Major, you hit a steel wall. Where's internal affairs when you need them? Why can't we get them to open an investigation on customs? You would not get away with this blind eye business if this was LA or Hong Kong. The Major says he's not going to screw over good police because of one nut with a pistol. But this isn't just one. Ask the executor this. If this is the stuff we're catching, what's slipping by? Well, we know at least where one of the plants was. Yep. Was there anything else in the room? I think there was another thing, you know? Nah. Free money. See? Nice. It's always cool to get them like that. Yeah, it is satisfying. Yep. We've got to be close now. Yeah, there's a stairwell further on. Executor's office is right above it. Let's hope we're not too late. 
Yeah, XP probably because we were full on Mary Jane. Uh, that can't be good. Did I become biotic or something? Yeah. Um, I don't usually see him use that power, so it confuses me a bit. Yeah, you're tier on piercing ammo to just increase damage to armor, I guess. Eh, let you pierce through more cover. Ah, uh, yeah, I guess that will do it too. Well done, thing. Get the word out. Odina's trying to seize power. I've got to get to the counselors. They're being taken to a shuttle pad on the Presidium. Start driving. I'll try to raise them on the comm. Fun. I've got a fix on the council's position. I'm sending it to your car. Good work, Bailey. We're almost there. Now we have saved the entire counselor's life twice. Not 
You could say. You know what they say, any landing you can walk away from. Yes, I suppose. Shepard, my instruments say your car stopped. I'm on foot now. Any luck contacting the council? Negative, their guards are dead. But we've still got vital signs on the council's transponders. I know you're there. I hate phantoms. They've got a one hit kill move, too. Ooh. Yeah, like, that sword isn't exactly for show. Yeah. Well, I guess that guy was, like, the leader of the phantoms or something. You could say he's the ultimate phantom. Uh, grenade got me. Well. There wasn't exactly a lot of room to maneuver there. Nope. At least checkpoints are pretty well. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, but it, it, yeah, but it was stop shooting and get stabbed or keep shooting and risk dying to jump the, the rest of them. Cover, cover. Yeah. That's a lot of fun, folks. Yeah, if you have James with James and Javik, uh, James is like, I gotta say, swords? Seriously? And Javik chimes in, fear, do not fear the weapon, fear its wielder. That's what I like about you, buggy. You're like Shun Tzu, but with more eyes. I mean, not the room. Oh, I thought there was a glass there. All I gotta say is, they get swords. Where's my sword? Right. Probably in another class. Probably in a different game called Andromeda. That too. It's like right around here where he says it. Oh, there's an atlas. I'm at Shalmar Plaza. Where's the castle? See through the smoke. Get up. Mm -hmm. All right, time to find the sun elevator. Grab a right again. What was that Power Ranger stances? Okay, I'm in the shaft. Hang on, this will be a fast climb. Tell me that assassin hasn't reached the council. He's trying, but I may 
making his elevator stop on every floor. Nice. <laughs> no, he has a lot of control over there. <laughs> Bye. Good riddance. Incoming phantoms. Uh oh. Guess you can shoot them. There is more Starburst Troopers on top of that one. Shepard? I see them. Jump! What was that? Gunman, get down! Who gave her a hand cannon? Go! He's with Severus. Everybody, hang on. Shepard, what's happening here? You know me better than this, Ash. I knew the old Shepard before Cerberus. Right now, I'm not sure who I'm dealing with. Really, I am. We don't have time to negotiate. You've been fooled, all of you. Odina's behind this attack. The Salarian Counselor confirmed it. Please, you have proof. You never do. There are Cerberus soldiers in the elevator shaft behind us. If you open that door, they'll kill you all. We've mistrusted Shepard before, and it did not help us. We don't have time to debate this. We're dead if we stay out here. I'm overriding the lock. I'm gonna regret this. No. You're not. Udina, step back from the console. To hell with this! Made it as fast as we could, Shepard. Looks like you uh, took care of things. Something's not right. You said Cerberus was targeting us. Where did their soldiers go? Cerberus was right here, but they beat feet into the Keeper tunnels when they figured out we were coming. Sorry, Counselor, I'll say it plain. Shepard just saved the lot of you. And you have saved my life twice now, Shepard. I owe you both a personal debt, and one on behalf of Palavan. You don't owe me anything, Counselor. Times like this, we all stand together. Commander, do you have any idea why the elusive man would do this? No, I don't. But I plan to find out. All right, people. Principals are evacuated. We got a tunnel and a million so more that's places what to secure. Looks like Move it. Armored up. Yeah, at least. They've been managing to get it up a bit. Things didn't go as planned. The Council's still in control of the Citadel and Udina's dead. Udina was expendable. Now what? There are other plans in motion. I'll fill you in when you return. I'm surprised you let Shepard get the better of you, Lane. It won't happen again. Mm hmm. We'll see.
We looked over every centimeter of those tunnels, Shepard. Your Cerberus pal is made out of smoke and mirrors. He likes to fight. He'll show up again. Pardon me if I'm not reassured by that. We can't even get an ID on him. He released a VI into the Citadel system that erased footage of him wherever he went. I guess he didn't trust that Adina's plan would come together. That reminds me, we got your friend Thane into work to Memorial. He's in for surgery. Apparently, uh, there's complications. Do you think he'll make it? I caught that they didn't have much drug blood on the Citadel. I notified his next of kin, his son, Koliat. He was the right blood type, but I don't know if he made it in time. We're pretty sure the route to the hospital is safe from Cerberus if you want to see him. Uh, I'd go now. I'll get on it. Oh, and you can tell him the Salarian counselor says he's a hero. You just, uh, I don't know, make things easier for him? complicated the situation. How are we supposed to predict the moves of an enemy we don't understand? Diver 2, do we have any AI enabled fragments of Sovereign? Any Reaper code I can analyze? No? Well then now keep out maneuvering our fleet in a sorry world. We keep burning. Always more to do. Yep. Man, there's a lot That's more probing here than there were before. Yeah. Gee, I wonder why. <laughs> Female Krogan, too. Nice. No, not that nice. <clears throat> yeah. Just nice. In the uh, original version of that, of the end of that mission, Bailey and his CSEC officers, the like two that were flanking him, uh, didn't have armor. Hmm. And the mass behind him, including the L core that was in armor, the big white one, which I've honestly never seen before, which is pretty cool. Uh, hmm. they weren't there at all. So that's probably that's part of that expanded mod. Yeah, it's part of the expanded mod, adding, you know, so much more to the game that it makes you wonder how you could play it without it. It's like, why would they show up at that point without that mod? Like, they've retaken headquarters. Come on. No, they're not just symbolic. The Asari revere a woman. She wore these rings after learning medicine from a fame herself. She was like a dalatress for your people. If we displayed her rings, we'd get more Asari support in the hospitals. So much to do. So little yep. time. Well, we do have a whole galaxy to save. Yeah. Again. Nobody here. Nobody here. 
was stabbed with a poison blade by a Cerberus soldier during the attack on the Citadel. We can't identify the toxin. We're barely keeping him alive right now. It's some form of neurotoxin. If you could look at our charts... Of course, I understand. Even a general is just one man. Good luck. Ouch. Can I help you? I'm looking for a drill named Thane Krios. Well, we have a drill, but not under that name. He was injured. Stabbed. Him. He's a regular patient here. It's all right, it's all right. I see. Mm. The doctors were able to repair a lot of the trauma. However, Mr. Mm. Krios is in the final stages of Keppel syndrome. At its worst, Keppel syndrome interferes with his blood's ability to carry oxygen. And he lost a lot. Now, they've given him transfusions, but frankly, there was a very limited supply of Drell blood on the Citadel. Is he still alive or not? Mr. Creo slips in and out of consciousness, and the outlook isn't good. It's hard to tell how much time he has. When he's awake, he's pretty lucid, never forgets anything. I think that helps. His son, Koliat, he's in there saying his goodbyes. You might want to say yours. Commander Shepard, my father mentioned you were no longer incarcerated. I don't know if you remember me. I'm Koliak Krios. I came to donate blood and, well, he asked me to take off his oxygen mask so he could be comfortable. I don't think it will be very long. Your father helped me save a lot of lives. I'd like to be here. Of course. Commander, I'm afraid I won't be joining you again. You've done more than enough, Bane. That assassin should be embarrassed. A terminally ill Drell managed to stop him from reaching his target. <laughs> I'll pass the word along. There is something I must do before it gets worse. I must... Mistress of inscrutable depths. I ask forgiveness. Kalihira, whose waves wear down stone and sand. Kalihira, wash the sins from this one and set him on the distant shore of the infinite spirit. Koliad, you speak as the priests do. You have been spending time with them. I brought a prayer book. Commander, would you care to join me? Kalihira, this one's heart is pure, but beset by wickedness and contention. Guide this one to where the traveler never tires, the lover never leaves, the hungry never starve. Guide this one, Kalihira. And he will be a companion to you as he was to me. Kolya? There's something I don't understand. His last moments were those of a hero. Why pray for salvation? The prayer was not for him, Commander. He has already asked forgiveness for the lives he has taken. His wish was for you. Goodbye, Fane. You won't be alone long. Hmm. <sighs> who lives or dies. That's not what we do. We help our patients, all of them. That's a nice sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. I've seen this happen in combat before. And we will run out of supplies. Have you seen the projections the administration center made? I have. 
The situation is going to get worse. What's your point? We can't deny the facts. If we prioritize them, some of our patients are in a much better position to survive. If we take care of them first and ration our supplies, we can save some now and enable ourselves to save more later. We cannot do that. We swore an oath to help the sick regardless of their economic situations or their places in society. Who are we to choose who lives or dies? That's not what we do. We help our patients. All oh. of That's a nice sentiment, but it won't help when we run out of supplies. I've seen this happen in Congress. Idealistic. Before. I would go with the realistic one. Have you seen the projections the administration has made? Okay. I have. Everyone makes sacrifices in wartime. You'll make yours. The one playing yesterday. I'm sure I will. But I'll do it without betraying my oath or my patience. It's not that simple. If we aren't careful about this now, we'll end up losing everyone. Then we'll find a way. Look, we have more fortunate patients, right? Yes. And I hate to say it, but the fortunate ones have far better survival odds. And more credits. So we ask them for donations to get more supplies for those without credits. What? Are you saying what I think you're saying? That's. You know, that, that actually might work. Okay, fine. I think it's still worked well. <laughs> I mean, at the end of the day, that was still the better option anyway. There's no, there's no real point spreading your medicine around if all it does is delay a hundred deaths. Yeah. If you can save, if you can save fifty, if you can save fifty by using the medicine, well, no one ever said war is pleasant. And chains and people down there. What a purgatory. Joker and Cortez are in a. Per Bar, so let's go visit them. We are here to help you have the best shore base ever. How's the head? Good. Concussion's almost gone. Good. When I heard you were injured, it was stupid. I should have ducked when that wall came down. Something good has come out of all this, though. Got new equipment. Send me a set of Vortex armor. Man, summoning supplies should mess that one up. Oh, I've heard those are pretty good. It's great. It'd only be safer inside a tank. That's why Vortex gear costs more than I make in a year. Will your new heavy armor keep you safe? I've watched reports on some of the things you're fighting. Well, it won't stop a Reaper, but an extra second of shielding can be life or death. So Vortex makes good shield capacitors? The best. They don't skip on plating either. Love it. Sounds like you want to get back out there to try it out. You know, a little. Can't wait to show it off to the team. Maybe I can take point more often now. Anyhow, enough about my armor. Let's find the gang and celebrate while I'm still here. What's your part? I took rapid transit. Come on, you have the fanciest ride on the Citadel. And I saw that new paint job. I, uh, I sold it a couple of weeks ago. What? But you love that car. I know. You never shut up about that. I know. Wait, wait. You asked if I got heavy armor. I never said it was heavy armor. Uh... And since when do you know anything about shield capacitors? I read about them. Did you say you sold your car a few weeks ago? Because that's around the time I got sent this new armor. Hey, hey, it's late. And I'm not letting my friend miss a night of purgatory, right? You want to go in, or do you want to talk about my car's... No, you're right. What's going? And I'm buying you some goddamn drinks. <laughs> True friend, That's right there. Nice. Yep. I mean, perhaps more confidence. Never know. Eh, never know. Never know. Okay, you're standing here. What's your deal? No, the problem is that our people are terrible at making war. The library at Asha had big room tests on the ways of the hunter. The defining works on the art of battle. But the Nimbus cluster has already fallen, and our people are here sort of dancing instead of fighting. She's got a point. Your side quest yet? Joker. So. Look at this! All it took was a Cerberus attack on the Citadel to get folks around here to pay attention to the war. How is this any different from normal? 
Can't you see the desperation? This isn't happy dancing. This is forget my problems dancing. Look at the arms. If a guy waves his arms like that, he's worrying about a lot more than looking stupid on the dance floor. That's surprisingly observant. I've had time to watch a lot of dancing from the sidelines. Speaking of which... Dancing? Watching from the sidelines. What do you think about me and Edie? <laughs> Why not? Because I could break a bone just from some light over the clothes action? That's always a risk. But then so are the Reapers. Yeah, I wasn't planning on dating Harbinger. You know what I mean. <laughs> if we all ended up dead this time tomorrow, what would you regret? Getting a shattered pelvis and a broken heart. Such a stupid idea. You deserve to be stupid. If you could be out yeah. there right now on the dance floor, would you be waving your arms? Yeah. Sounds like you've got bigger things to worry about than looking stupid. Yeah, guess I do. Now, if you'll excuse me. It's good that robot to learn. Something like that. Okay, Edie's supposed to be here somewhere, but I don't see her. But speaking of which... It's always mm -hmm. Cortez for that matter, unless they're up here. Oh, yeah. There's Edie. Yeah, this place is so clean and sweet. Anyhow, thanks for the drink. But well, why are you dragging me out here? You, uh, still got that emotion for you? Yeah. Looking for work. Might as well. What you got? Criminals have standards. Mm-hmm. Haven't broken anything yet. That's a start. It seems Edie doesn't have anything to say. Where's Cortez? There he is. Shepard, you made it. Come have a drink with me. You're looking happy. You had it right. Yesterday can't change. Tomorrow, we might all be dead. Today is what matters. I'm not wasting it. I wouldn't have thought a club would be to your taste. You don't have to get all hot and bothered to appreciate graceful dancing. There's an energy here. There's light. And some of the eye candy in the crowd isn't too shabby either. <laughs> the eye candy on the stage is fine by me. <laughs> Good. I sure don't need you as competition. <laughs> here. To you, Steve. And to you, Shepard. A good friend when I needed one most. Thank you. For everything. That's nice. Good shuttle pilot. Be happy. Yay. Uh, right. Still need to head up to Presidium Commons. You remember a few missions ago when we were helping that Turian squad and we found some turret schematics? Uh, sorta. Don't you think those would be kind of useful right now? Yeah, probably. A courtyard and a CSEC outpost. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 
take Earth back. <laughs> nice. Yeah, there's a... And then there's that. Fleet and Flotilla. It's literally a Cory and Turian romance uh, video. But still, it's not only there's a lot more military uh, things yeah. in the Citadel, huh? Hmm. What's this about a wounded Batarian? If you want my security vids, bring me a warrant. You're stonewalling me? Those vids could be vital for the war effort. I doubt the Reapers have agents doing business in my cafe. We're trying to protect you. Jesus. Hell of a job to do. See those scorch marks? Cerberus killed one of my servers right there. Where were you? Hey, I lost friends too. If you care about finding the Cerberus informants who made it happen, You'll give me the bids. Is there even really a question of who we're supposed to support here? No. We're at war. If you care about the safety of the Citadel, you'll help CSEC however you can. Thank you, Spence. I have some high-profile customers. If word gets out that I'm ratting them out to CSEC, you think I care about insider trading or electronic smuggling right now? I'm after the best of the tactics. Nobody else. We've got my all right, just like, helps. like a bit of tax fraud right now is kind of insignificant. Yeah. Should we tell the Krogan that there's no fish in the lakes up here? That seems to be a recurring question. <laughs> oh, maybe. Uh, no, they don't have it. I'm looking for that part that the engineers want us to get. Ah. Uh, Definitely yeah, not here. Part. That's just close. That's a lot of outfits you'll never wear, truly. Pretty much. Was any of the other stuff any good anyway? Like capacitor or something is out there. I think I want to support the Warrior Merchant on this one. Yeah. Especially given how many sleeper agents Cerberus had. Yep. Would a bunch of civilians shooting at anything that moves make the Citadel safer? The commander's right. Maybe if the council organizes a civilian militia with training. Otherwise, they'll just panic and get themselves killed. I just. I just want people to be safe. I know. But second guessing c -Sec isn't the way. What if we submit a proposal to start a militia? Okay. That'd be something. Welcome to Agor Munitions. It's a start. The mentos are probably also useful. It's probably over at Elkos Combine. And there's Liara. Sounds Might as well talk to Liara. Hello, Shepard. Who costs to, as you say, just about everything? Yeah. Commander Shepard, do you have a minute? Can I help oh, you? Oh, hey. Jordan Knowles, E-Crimes. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. Oh, never mind. No, we don't know her. I've got a saboteur hacking key systems. Power she looked a lot like the girl we saved in the communications got time to help, <laughs> check station. Out this console. Got it. It looks like a collection of access codes. They're Batarian diplomatic codes from back when they had an embassy on the Citadel. If you can use your Spectre access to find them, I can shut them down. I can access restricted intel at the Spectre office in the embassy. If I find anything, I'll let you know. Okay, then. More things to do. Mm-hmm. Look, the asshole's in custody now. Killing him won't bring anyone back. It's about justice. The man is a traitor and a murderer. You saw what he did to your wife. To my husband. And didn't bat an eye on him. He's evil, there's no doubt. What's going on here? I'm in position at CSEC. Draw them away, and I'll move in and make the kill. Don't answer that. What? 
I got confused. Kind of on defense on that one. Mm. Let's keep law and order. Everyone on the Citadel knows we're at war now. You have to show them that CSEC is still in control. They need that security. The commander's right. We need people coming into work every day. We need things to keep running. Otherwise, today's bar fight could be tomorrow's street riot. Yeah, maybe you're right. This feels so damn petty right now. Now, what just went down around the corner? And what this is, is apparently there's someone in CSEC custody who's a, a, who's a traitor and a terrorist. And they're supposed to arrange a distraction for him to go in and execute him. But Shepard said no. Commander Shepard, guess I know what happened to my backup. <laughs> Excuse me? Come on, I'm in CSEC in civilian gear with a weapon. I know what I'm made. Just let me explain. Captain Aaron Summers, Alliance Marines, retired. Captain Summers? There's a prisoner here. CSEC officer who helped Cerberus. CSEC caught him when you stopped the coup. Now he's offering them intel on Cerberus to get a better deal. Why are you telling me this? Because he doesn't deserve a better deal. He killed people during the coup. Good people. And he's former Alliance, like us. The way I figure it, he's our problem to fix. Tell me what this guy did to deserve death. He executed his own friends in cold blood for Cerberus. Cleared the path for their troops. Now he's saying he's a vet. And he was suckered in by talk of helping humanity. I don't know what intel he has, and I don't really care either. He dishonored the uniform. <laughs> I, like, I like the phrasing there. Let me do it legally. <laughs> Nah. If you gun that man down, you're dishonoring the uniform just as much as he did. Like hell I am. I don't like plea bargains any more than you do, but the intel we get will save lives. Says who? Our superiors. The people we swore to serve and trust. Captain Summers. Yes, Commander. Sorry, Commander. I'll shut it down. Thanks. Sometimes you gotta be rem reminded of the oath you swore. Yup. Also, the chain of command, even if it's technically not in it anymore. Yeah, well... If he's gonna call, uh... Alliance an Alliance problem... Then he may as well consider himself part of that chain of command. Yeah. Like, he said he's ex-Alliance, but he still referred to himself yeah. as... Yep. Yeah, well, I guess we know where I guess we know where those uh, turret schematics belong. So it seems. These are control schematics for Cerberus turrets. Will these help? Damn right they will. I'll have you crimes dig into them. Might even help us find the little present Cerberus left for us. Thanks a lot. This is gonna save lives. That's a bad ad. Yep. So I guess in an era like this, it doesn't require much convincing. <laughs> That's the N7 Elite mm. right there. Yep. Uh, the Paladin, Destroyer, Juggern... Uh, I forget half the names. You know the ones that the, in the XCOM classes are based off that we have? Yeah, yeah. I get it. <laughs> Pretty much the only reason I even recognized them. Hmm. 
classified project. It needs all the proof you want intel we can find. I haven't found any reliable pictures, but just think. If those statues had something that could help us, even today. Why should I trust them? They could stop Cerberus. What could they possibly do about the Reapers? Nothing if you take your money and hide. Okay, we missed most of that because we went over to listen to her. This Ooh. guy's got money, but he's fleeing to one of the, uh, basically it's like a refugee area. Ah. And this guy's saying, no, fuck that, stop, we need the money. Have you seen Palavin or Earth? You can't escape this war. At least here you've got the council fighting for you. But to fight, they need money. Money this bank has loaned them using accounts like yours. Okay, okay, damn it. Leave the account open. Besides, how can some place like Sanctuary promise more safety than the Citadel? You're right. Guess all we can do is hope for the best. I mean, at the end of the day, as long as they're not taking with their pants down like they were this time, the Citadel is the most fortified place in the galaxy. Yeah, especially now that they keep their side fixed. Yeah. Welcome to Combine Arsenal Supplies. Uh, EGL Thermal Yeah, there we go. With the light pistol materials and um, stuff. You should totally buy the server of someone and use it everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> that would go well. up well. My people are still afraid, but they are remembering who they are. Oh, yeah. Yeah, remember we found the book for him. Mm hmm. Okay. There's still a lot to do on the Citadel, but we're pushing time once again. Yeah. So, we we'll will have a... handle all of that. Yeah. Next time. Next time. Bye-bye.